What's up, you crazy YouTubers? It's Mike from the Autograph Network coming to you with a promo video. Uh, no mail today, so I'm going to take the time that I would normally do my mail days and do a uh, about a five five minute video for my buddy uh, Polly C, Paul Cavelli. He is doing an awesome thing, guys. He, you know that he's done in the past his weekly giveaways, which I've done promos for every week that he had them. Um, not for the cards he was giving away, but for just, you know, promoting a good person in the community. He's doing another good thing, guys. He's doing another giveaway. Um, basically giving away a $10 credit where he'll get you something off eBay for uh, $10 or less. And just, you know, his way of giving back. And it's such a good thing. You know, i got nothing but nice things to say about Polly. So I'm uh, more than happy to do this. And he's doing something pretty cool. Um, watch the video for the rules. Follow the rules, guys. It's not an I'm, I'm in situation. It's you have to make a video response and you have to talk about a couple of things. And it's pretty cool what you have to do. Um, I'll just go over it real quick. You have to, and I'll go over all these, but um, state why you started collecting, uh, what it means to you to collect cards today, and uh, your favorite team or player and why. Um, why? why I started collecting um, like many kids I grew up playing sports it just went hand in hand um, when you you're a kid you have dreams and aspirations of being a professional athlete uh, whatever sport you play <clears throat> for me it was baseball you know I wanted to be a pro pro baseball player never panned out but uh, to collect cards was you know to get your hands on something you watch these guys you idolize these guys growing up it was just a natural occurrence when you when you wanted to be one of those guys that you picked up cards and uh... you know i don't remember exactly the cards i first started getting but you know i grew up in michigan so i was a tigers fan and uh... this is uh... the eighty eighty three fleer tiger set just I mean, these are just base cards, guys, and um, <clears throat> this was long before jersey cards and autograph cards, and this is what cards were back then. Um, I'm a lot older than a lot of you guys, so this is this is what it was. But I mean, I I grew up watching these guys, and to me, that's that's what cards were. You know, getting your hands on your favorite players' cards. It has nothing to do with book value. You know, I haven't looked at a Beckett in probably 20 years. Um, the value of cards goes way beyond money. I don't, I'm not here to chase hits or stuff like that. And if, if you do, that's, you know, you're right. You can do that. But to me, it's, it's more about the memories. And that gets me into the, what card collecting means to me today and back then. It, it was about memories and it still is. Um, when you guys send me just because and it has base cards of you know some of the older players or you know older base cards you know I can thumb through those and just look at the cards and be like oh wow I remember seeing him play or I saw him you know this and that you know these I have pages and I just pulled some out guys I showed you the this is just the Tiger team set um, these are just Lance Parrish base cards. You know, nothing nothing really worth anything. But to me they they're invaluable. These were from my childhood. And uh like I said, what it means to collect cards is, you know, memories. These have great memories of watching these guys play. Um they'll be great memories, hopefully for when I pass them on to to my son. You know, I have great memories of going down to spring training and um, hanging out with my dad at the ballpark and uh, you know this is just this was a card that it, it's an 83 Donruss Diamond King um, just a cool card I mean imagine getting that in a pack when you're you know 10 years old that's how excited I was to get this and uh, being a Tigers fan I loved Lance Parrish it was my favorite Tiger um, got this autograph my mom wrote that on there um, in Lakeland at spring training in 86 so this card you know has great memories for me 
Um, I remember meeting Lance Parrish for the first time. Um, I wanted to be Lance Parrish. Show you this card here. See that black glove? I had that glove. I was a catcher and in the little league and uh just I mean that's that's what it was to me. Cards were a way to be a little closer to sports and it probably was one of the reasons that you know I couldn't play so I went I went and worked in professional sports and some of you guys know that I worked in the minor leagues and basically I was as close to the players as you can get without being an actual player I mean I was in the clubhouse sitting in the dugouts going on road trips with them so um, lastly my favorite team and players um, growing up the 84 Tigers were my absolute favorite team um, probably my first memories as a kid watching the World Series and uh, meeting some of the guys down in spring training. Um, it was just, that was the cat's meow. Um, also the Seattle teams, because I lived out there. Um, got to see a lot of Mariners games. Also the uh, Supersonics. Um, I worked for the Supersonics, so I got to see an entire season of basketball games at Key Arena in Seattle. Um, Seahawks, yeah. Um, also the Lions, um, even though that's tough. <laughs> but, you know, I got to grow up watching Barry Sanders, too. I mean, the team, Detroit as a team sucked, but um, watching Barry Sanders play every Sunday was uh, pretty exciting. So, um, so that's my video. You know, just wanted to share some cards to me or it's not about book, book value, um, it's about the memories, and uh, just looking at these, man, takes me back to, uh, remember, getting some of these cards, I mean, some of these cards are 20, 20, almost 30 years old, and uh, God, I could just, you know, brings me back, I'm just thumbing through these, so, I mean, it's cool to, to reminisce, and brings back some good memories and that's what it's about is the good memories you know trading trading with friends growing up uh, opening opening packs at the local card shop you know getting birthday presents and opening those and that's that's what it's about guys so hopefully Polly you like this video and if you guys watch this I know it wasn't TTMs or anything but uh, you know it's cool to kind of share some experiences and uh, talk about it a little bit so Alright guys, Mike from the Autograph Network is...